All right, here's how to make a sparkler bomb. you're going to need is one roll of electrical tape for every 24 sparklers and uh, the tape is going to be around 50 to 60 feet per roll. Now when making a sparkler bomb you need to use colored sparklers. We use Showtime sparklers. Showtime sparklers have been the best for us so far. First thing you're going to need. Now that you've finished unwrapping your sparklers you're going to bundle them up and leave one sparkler out to act as a fuse. For our fuse, we chose these Black Cat Extra Long Sparklers. After you have your fuse sticking out, you're going to wrap the top to keep it together first, and then you're going to wrap the bottom. All right, after you have the first layer done, you're going to keep repeating. Now, after every two or three rolls of tape, depending on how big your sparkler bomb is, you're going to start doing the top and bottom. Now, what I do with the top is I take separate pieces of tape and go one by one each way until I get to the center. Then I turn it to 90 degrees and go one by one each way. And I do two layers of that for each time doing the top. After you have the top and bottom wrap, continue wrapping. This is an optional idea, but we're putting epoxy on the top to prevent it from turning into a rocket. We use these with the bigger ones. 